I welcome all of you on platform of your PD education and uh, you are watching the series of videos which we are uploading to inform you about various higher education and job courses in Germany uh, where uh, you can join the universities and very uh, important industrially related courses for masters and PhD. You know I'm coming out with the now a series of uh, uh, videos related to uh, some very very cheap universities though very good universities offering good career opportunities after masters when i'm saying cheap that means the expenditure which i told you last time like in germany if you want to pursue your studies in germany then overall expenditure per month uh, if tuition fees is not there and normally in majority of universities tuition fee is not there and we will target only those universities where tuition fee is not there. Uh, so if tuition fee is not there, then approximately 800 euro, euro is approximately 89, 90 rupees. So 800 euro is required per month for you to survive in those uh, universities in Germany. And course is approximately of two years duration. So that means you have to spend somewhere, uh, you should have in your pocket somewhere 10 to 15 lakh rupees. But 50% of that will come back because you can do some job over there. Now, in this series, I'm going to discuss with you those universities which are cheap, not in the main cities like Berlin, Frankfurt or uh, Stuttgart, not in those main cities, but little away from main cities, right? Where cost of living is very cheap. So 800 euro will come down to 500, 600 euro. That is very uh, cost effective. And at the same time, working opportunities are also there. So even those students who want to go for MS, because MS means scholarship opportunities are less, even those students can optimize their entire MS program within a couple of lakhs, three, four lakh rupees. And maybe you can even do away that also if you are if you get really good opportunity, job opportunity there. That I will discuss later on how to get it. This video is related to one of the course, like mechatronics robotics course which electrical engineer, mechanical engineer, electronics engineer, instrumentation engineer, it is a combined course for them. So mechatronics and robotics course in one of the universities, Shivel Kaldan University, if I'm rightly pronouncing this name, this University of Applied Science is offering this course, there's no tuition fees, and there are so many universities like that. I'll keep on telling you how to do it. So my purpose is not to tell you about the universities and cheap courses my purpose is to help you how to identify these universities uh, so you can actually find out these universities I, as i told you in the, my previous videos i told you what is the dart all about and how uh, phd in german is a job where you get uh, more than thousand euro as scholarship so in phd you can earn very comfortably and that is what my series of this is going on and i told you something about that in the previous videos also what is dart all about and how we have to go on the site of dart and once we go on the site of dart we have to go for international programs that is programs for indian students what are the various programs for indian students and how to type suppose you are interested for mechatronics and robotics you know you as engineer you have done something in rob robotics and mechatronics and you have learned certain things there certification courses or something now you want to join this course in german universities just write it here type the course ms course master's course or phd course language english language and if some field uh, further specialization field comes like engineering because mechatronics and robotics can be done by science students also not only engineering so this i just typed here master's course and then english language may i want to pursue and engineering so seven options popped up for me these seven options of universities in german and these are those options you know so there is a construction and robotics rwth university and i told you that this university even accept gate score because for pursuing the education in germany all you need to know is all you need to have is gr is not required but toefl or ielts one of the english language uh, uh, degrees required but in some universities if your final year is in english if that certificate is given to you by the university then even ielts is not required and for Indian students, even GATE is taken in some of the universities. This, I think, RWTH is one of such universities. 
so uh, tuition fee is not there civil engineers can target construction and robotics as one domain because you know we talk about now 3d buildings using 3d printing method and that can be a very very good domain for us so when the sum uh, this semester is starting so beginning and everything that detail you can get from here similarly msc in robotic systems and engineering again the same university but there is a tuition fee master of science in embedded system engineering so again tuition fee is not there so keep on watching and you will see many opportunities there so i will be discussing in detail about this why i liked it because it is mechatronics and robotics very general course and the cost of living i found is very less here that obviously lot of search is to be done you have to go to each university and see where is this located what is the cost of living what are the opportunities of job near uh, around these universities you know everywhere you will not get opportunity of job i give you example of india suppose you do your masters or phd in bombay so bombay and khadakpur they are two different places right iits are equally good but khadakpur mein job opportunity may not be there but bombay mein you will get lot of uh, uh, job opportunities similarly nid similarly other universities so this university is located in a place where you can get Uh, uh, out of the campus uh, jobs also and uh, you can uh, the living cost is very very cheap here for indian students and these are the uh, what indian as indian students what do we look forward is like cost of living should be less 800 euro se reduce okay 500 600 euro ho jaye aur mere ko job opportunity mil jaye during masters so that i should not spend money from my pocket learning should be good and after masters i get job these are two three things for us right so that is what we need to do it Similarly, Industry 4.0 पे ये काम कर रहा है Engineering and Sustainable Technology. I found it really good course, but you know there's a tuition fee. So those of you who are rich people, rich guys, you know they can find very good courses, very good things, and tuition fee you have to pay. Master of Science in Embedded System, as I told you already, and then this is a Bionics MSc, IT Engineering. So students from this you know computer science background they can avail this. now i come to this particular part which i i told you after lot of survey i found this to be really good course for indians so i found it uh, i went there and uh, i saw what is the degree what are the requirements cost and funding requirements services all these things once you do 15 june is the date when you can apply and uh, semester starts from 10 1st october you know and by 15th june we have to apply in this university so because of the covid here and there little bit delay can be there so this is the detail which i got it when you go into the detail of description of the content you know these are the elective modules automation control digital signal processing systems theory this is what you are going to study in that vibration engineering and all so by seeing this you will feel that okay if you are from mechanical background electrical background electronics background this is what uh, are the domains you have to specialize and you have to study Okay, now there is no tuition fee. As I was telling you, why I chose it, no tuition fee, and it is very affordable because cost of living living is approximately five hundred fifty euro per month, from eight hundred euro on an average to five fifty euro. So we are saving here couple of euros, right? Two hundred fifty euros we are saving here. So cost of living is somewhere around this. And uh, another thing which I found is like uh, you know uh, you uh, proof of bachelor studies can be given. That means. even if you don't write ielts then you can give proof of bachelor studies of english that one what what you have studied in bachelors btech or be that is studied in english if that proof is given from college or something then i think that will also be condoned this is the best part possibility of finding part time employment so there are two good things here number one cost of living 800 euro to 550 euro there is no tuition fee another good thing then proof of bachelor studies in english maybe ielts is not required so there is a another part of this and and uh, and 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 what else yes and this is the best part there are so many medium sized companies where you can get jobs they are looking for part time employees so we doing while doing ms or phd we will be looking for part time jobs that is another good thing for us so uh, this university provides a dedicated career service for this you know the best part about the universities in germany is like they understand students from countries like india they will self sustain and then they need to have some kind of job opportunities for them so they help you to save money in dormitories staying together and couple of distance from university so cost of living is to be reduced so all these benefits are actually uh, provided by the Uh, counseling departments of these universities 
so this is what i found and where is this uh, if i say berlin is the basically uh, reference point for us so it is somewhere around i think uh, 300 400 kilometers from that particular uh, location i mean from berlin you know so this is uh, uh, the location of that particular point yeah it is 356 kilometers from berlin on the way of lipzig and lipzig and then it this is the university which we are talking about and if another uh, reference if i tell you uh, from frankfurt this one is near you know frankfurt is another uh, why i'm mentioning about frankfurt and berlin because air direct air flights are to these places like frankfurt uh, air uh, there's a flight to frankfurt there's a flight to berlin stuttgart so from there how far it is so from frankfurt i think it is a 2 hour journey 180 kilometers so it is only 2 hour journey which you can reach there this is that university and uh, this is a location which i was talking uh, about this is the location of that university you know uh, you can access all these details on the link provider and you can see what this course is all about and what they offer you so there are two departments involved electrical department mechanical department in this particular course uh if you ask me honestly then uh, you know the process of application in german university is very simple it is not difficult all you need to do is you need to apply that is all you need to do is you need to apply and the probability of selection is far far more than probability of selection in india in iits so if you say sir i got great score and i want to get admission in iits so what is the probability of my selection and what is my probability of selection in german the only difference is in india number of courses seats are less and number of students are more and that is the reverse in countries like germany so number of students who are aspiring to get into these courses is less and number of courses are more and highly industry oriented specialized courses so that is the advantage and another good point is throughout the year like in iits you see uh, all the iits almost the admission season is same you know but uh, in germany kind of countries the universities keep on admitting you throughout the year especially for phd courses so this is what is required this is the details which you require that's all so i will keep on popping up with the new courses new uh, departments and regular zoom interactions you can have with the the mentors of your pedia regular zoom interactions so that you can get benefited any query any questions if you have you can discuss with the mentors of your pedia thank you